Hey guys, it's Jen and welcome back to Sim Airport. So we have an issue right here with uh, the restroom, it looks like. Never mind. Alright, the restroom was just having a bad day, I guess. <laughs> so when we last left off, we had finished making the giant building over here, along with two restrooms and some benches, which apparently uh very busy over here. Anyway, um, this area is going to be used all for ticketing, so people can buy their plane tickets. We're going to have a bunch of ticketing desks over there, a bunch of staff. Uh, we're gonna put a kiosk area over here probably. It's gonna look real nice compared to this. And then this area is gonna be all security. And then this right here is the baggage claim area, which I really like. I, I really, I'm really glad that I added this because pretty much now I can have up to 12 airplane gates and not have to worry about the carousels being full, which is really cool. Also, this area right here is gonna be a vending machine area. Uh, it's gonna have like, you know, drinks and stuff. Actually, is anybody, wait, wait a second. Nobody's buying drinks either, are you kidding me? Is, is everybody like living off of chips and cookies? What's going on over here? Also, I want to work on the idea of the road thing that I had in the last episode by having it like go like this. And hopefully uh, this works. Please be enough. We don't have enough money for this, but uh, hopefully this works. So we're going to do this. That's a lot of money. Oh, $8,000 per block of road? Is, is the cement made out of gold? What's... How, why is this, why is this, I can't even speak from how flabbergasted I am. Also, are the workers actually working? <laughs> I think they're actually working. Alright, we're, we're fine there. Also, right here, there is an exit or entrance over here. Um, and I'm not sure if this makes it so, like, if I put the entrance right here, right? Will they go through here and then immediately up to here? If, like, if it's a drop-off area. I have no idea, just in case, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna do that just in case, maybe... Maybe that's how it works. I have no idea. I'm also going to go ahead and expand the uh, the pickup area because right now everybody and their mother is huddling up over here. So we can't have that. We have to have it be very spread out also because there's a lot of traffic caused by this and we can't have a lot of traffic due to that. And, uh, excuse me? Why would, are you, are you, a, are you an idiot? Where'd you get your license? Now, now you literally cannot move from there until I finish the road. How can you be so dumb? Alright, so this one truck right here just completely broke the game, I guess, for me. Because right now, this this truck right here. Is there a way for me to make him disappear? Why is he even here? Get out of here. No? Alright. Can How about you? I can tell him to leave. Leave! Oh, that, that worked. Alright. Oh, these are the... These are the delivery trucks. Are you guys a bunch of idiots? Why would you even come over here? So now we can't build anything because the idiots over here. Oh my gosh. All right, how about, I don't even know. How do, how do you get rid of this? Because we can't make anything because all the supplies are on the delivery trucks. But we also can't get rid of the delivery trucks. All right, we're, we're going we're gonna to go ahead and try some, some stuff out. All right, so I went ahead and just completely removed the road there. And what I'm going to do is, I'm going to go ahead and do this. I'm going to put a road right here. Hopefully the delivery guy. All right, there we go. And now we need to start working on this road. I'm, I'm gonna do it backwards. That way they don't somehow end up over here. All right, road, build that. Yes, there we go. Now get out of here. Be free. All right, so the new road system is now done. It's it hasn't really changed much, has it? It's still it's still a lot of traffic, unfortunately. But you know what? That's what happens when you're a very successful airport. All right. You're gonna have a lot of people, you have a lot of bus- Why do we have so many buses to begin with? Can we fire a few buses or make them, you know, not all come into the airport at once? Alright, so I think it's time we start working on the, uh, the ticketing area, alright? I'm gonna add, you know, bushes and all that and carpet after the entire thing is done. But for right now, we're gonna focus on actually getting it working. So we need- Where is it? We need, uh, ticketing desks and a bunch of kiosks. All right, so the uh, the ticketing desks are now in. We're gonna go ahead and add a new ticketing zone, right? Pretty much this, this entire thing is gonna be ticketing, so let's go ahead and do that. There we go, ticketing. That is all ticketing. And now we can go ahead and, and pretty much remove all of this. We don't really need this, so let's go ahead and do that. Uh, let's remove this zone down here. Nobody's gonna be using this anyway, so let's go ahead and just, yeah, just get rid of all that. We're also gonna get rid of all the supplies there, so clear all of this. Also, before I forget, we need to attach the carousel thing onto this. So let's go ahead and do that. So carousel, wait, where is it? It's under utilities, I think, right? Yeah, all right, conveyor line. So, 
Uh, we can just do it like this, I think. I've, I've, I'm forgetting how to do this. <laughs> Alright, so that. And then we can go ahead and move it like this. And then attach it directly to this. I hope. I have no idea how else it would work. I think it's right, so... Let's go ahead and remove all this extra conveyor line. Like that. Yep, it's working. Alright, good. Alright, so I'm not sure what's going on over here, but uh, apparently everyone's huddling up, so... Uh, are they, like, waiting in a group? Are they in line for the ticketing desks? It looks like they are. Oh. You guys know there's a bunch more ticketing desks down here, right, that you can come visit. For the low, low price of the same thing as up here. No? Alright, got it. You know what, it seems like past this one, no one's using these. So what I'm going to do instead is I'm going to go ahead and actually clear the ones down here. So these right here are going to just all be gone, and I'm going to replace them all with a ticketing kiosk area. Alright, so first off, we're going to put a wall right here. That way we're going to put a door right here, and hopefully this doesn't cut anybody off, because I, I hope that the, that the people I hired know how to work a door, so... Uh, I forgot where the door is. I think it's under here. Yep, alright, door. So, hopefully my employees aren't idiots. Put a door there. Now they can enter and go back here. Uh, do, do we have enough employees for this? We don't have enough employees for this? Oh my gosh, wait. Are they all at the gate desk? Alright, so we do have people at the gate desk. We just don't have enough employees for the, uh, the ticketing desks. Let's go ahead and... How do we not have enough staff for this? Are you kidding me? One, two, three, four, five, six. And then... Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seven. Where's the other, like, fifteen I have? Are they all taking a break? Are they hiding from me? Maybe they're at home. You know what, forget it. I'm just gonna hire more of them. Wait a second. Wait a wait a second. When I hire one, they they just dis disappear or something. Alright, I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and put that person right there. I'm gonna go ahead and click here and follow them. I wanna see where they're going. Where are you going? Mm-hmm. Interesting, interesting. The day in the are, are you kidding me? Do we need more people here? There's 13 of you here? How many are here? Just just one person over here? See that person knows what he's doing. What, what's wrong with you guys? You're fired. You're fired. You're all fired except for that one person. I actually, am, <laughs> I actually ended up firing everybody because I didn't know how many were there. All right. So now we have only apparently 29. Where's everybody else? I don't understand. All right. Well, I, I don't know where else to, to go with this. So I'm going to go ahead and just assume that. Are you kidding me? You're still waiting there? Who are you? Oh, you're a staff member? Are you? You're on the wrong side of the ticketing desk, sir. You're fired for not knowing how to use a freaking desk. Oh, wait a second. Can he not get back there because of the door? Really? I hired, did I hire idiots? Look, just remove the door. We're just going to remove the door because apparently no one here knows how to use a door anyway, so. Remove the door and then hire staff to work here. Where, where are you going now? Alright, so you went over there, but there was no one there to begin with. So that, that means somebody took the spot over here. Oh, they actually did. Alright, so we need one more staff, I guess. Hire one more staff over here. Apparently not. One more staff. More. 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 Are they all full? No, there's one more. More. Alright, I have no idea what's going on anymore. Alright, forget it. No more employees because they keep getting stuck in that one ticketing desk and I'm not sure why. But uh, over here, it looks like everything's going fine. They're all using the ticketing area. And there seems to be a huge group of people here just waiting like their turn. I'm not sure why they would all huddle up at the door. Because then, how are other people supposed to get in? Can we hire security guards? Or we should probably just put down a queue. That probably worked better <laughs> than hiring security guards to move them. It'd probably also help if we had some kiosks. Let's go ahead and actually put these down. So, let's go ahead and do that, and then a bunch of kiosks, and... Yeah, alright, so the people who don't, who don't want to talk to others, you know, maybe they're having a bad day. Let's put down some decorative bushes over here in the corner. Are there trees? Can we put down some trees? Oh, we do have trees. Oh, wait a second, I don't want bushes everywhere then. I want a palm tree. Oh, wait, that's, that's for outside, probably. Yeah, that's for outside. Dang it! How about this? Can this go in, inside? What do you mean? It's a freaking tree in the... Oh my gosh, how about... About this, can this go inside? No. Are there any trees that can go inside? You're telling me we can't freaking put a tree in a little vase and put it inside? Ah, oh, forget it. We'll go back to the bushes. All right. So the last thing to do here is add a queue. So we'll add it from like right here, and then have everyone go around like this. And this is gonna look so bad. 
All right, there we go. So that's the, uh, the new queue for this area. And that should work perfectly fine. Hopefully, everyone and their mother does not come and visit at the same time. Let's go ahead and assign all these to the uh, queue, and then that'll be it. All right, so we have an issue. Um, apparently, these ticketing desks are too far away. Uh, are you too far away? You're too far away, too. You're perfectly fine. So you're fine over here. All right, I have an idea. I have an idea. So the ones at the far end, because I think this one should work for the queue. All right. So the, the, the two or the four at the far end, two on each side, those are going to be just for first class. So this queue right here is going to be for coach only. And yeah, all right. So that, that this works. This It works fine. I didn't mean for it to work this way, but it works. All right. So there we go. This is the first class queue. Are you okay, madam? Are you are you okay? Did you forget how to how to go behind a desk? All right, it's going to fire you because I'm, I'm not sure what's wrong with you. But anyway, uh, first class queue over here. I try to make this one identical to this one, so that's why it's like the same shape. So first class over here for these two, and then coach in the middle right here. And the, the coach line kind of shrunk a little bit because I needed to make it so it, it didn't look as bad and also wanted to make it a little bit you know at, at least a little bit symmetrical because it looked really weird to have like all the queue on this side like over over here and no queue on this side and then i didn't know what to put there if i put nothing over there then that would look weird but yeah it's it just it was all bad all right it was all it was all horrible i changed things up it looks better now in my opinion now we can add some stuff to it first things first Oh my gosh, that's like the perfect size for the benches. All right, good. <laughs> I wasn't actually like making sure of that. I just hoped that it uh, it was. Uh, maybe we shouldn't do it like that. Let's go ahead and do it like this. Put one over here. Wait, nope, that's facing the wrong way. Like this, and then one over here. Uh, and then... So now all that's left to do is expand the security area. We're going to make this the best dang security area any airport has ever freaking had and then next episode we'll probably work on um, adding more airplane gates and just changing up the main building but for right now oh wait 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 i also want to make the the vending machine room let's do that first since it's not that big of a deal let's go ahead and clear this go ahead and clear this and then we can move all of that into here so we need a vending oh gosh what did i clear i clicked something by accident all right never mind i'm a ma magician boo oh not a magician <laughs> i'm a i'm a prankster I don't know why I said boo, alright? Calm down. Uh, let's go ahead and put some vending machines over here. A bunch of vending machines. Then down here, we're going to put electronic vending. And we probably should put a drink machine just in case. Because at some point... Wait a second! Wait a second! Does the drink machine belong in the kitchen? No way! Do not tell me these belong in the kitchen. It would make sense. Because... No way. If that fixes it, I'm going to be... My, my mind is going to be blown if that fixes it. So looking through this, I just realized there's more to add to the kitchen than I, I thought. I didn't know we could add coffee makers and stuff to it. Sure, why not? Let's add a coffee maker, a uh, drink machine. Retail staff uses this machine to pour soft drinks. Thirsty uh, passengers like soft drinks. You earn money for each transaction too. All right. Oh my gosh, there's so much to do here. I wish that the that people actually were interested in buying stuff. Is there anything else we can add to uh, the kitchen? Can we not put a sink in there, like, for the employees to wash their hands? Because, like, I don't know about you guys, but if I order a cheese pizza and end up with bits of pineapple on there, I'm going to be kind of mad because I don't like pineapple on pizza. I don't like pepperoni on pizza. Actually, I love pepperoni on pizza. I don't like pineapple on pizza. I don't like grapes on pizza i don't like veggies on pizza i just want cheese bacon pepperoni i want i want cheese pizza that when i look at it i'm like dang i'm gonna get fat helps with supply oh wait what we have a storage i didn't even know about this why didn't anybody, anybody tell me about this here here you go guys i didn't if you had told me about this i would have helped you I, I didn't know we could put could uh, use these there you go Place down a bunch of them in the deliveries area. There you go. What else can we put in these areas that I didn't notice yet? Dumpster helps keep trash under control by increasing. The... Oh my gosh, there's so much that I didn't even know it uh, notice before. That's so cool. 
Why didn't I know about all this? Here. I'm gonna put a bunch of dumpsters here. And hopefully this makes it so, like, the garbage trucks pick up the garbage faster because we spend way too much time cleaning up garbage. I like how I did these zones pretty much perfectly. I didn't even plan for them to be this perfect. Oh my gosh. Also, I want to raise the price on the airport usage, but at the same time, I don't want to because then our airline interest will go down. Then we lose airlines and then we lose money because, yeah. So, what I want to do is I want to increase our airline interest. I don't know if I'm going to get to the security area this episode, but the ticketing area is pretty much done. I'm not sure what else I can add to it. Like, I can add decorations and stuff to it, but right now, like, it's serving its purpose, all right? It's doing what it needs to do. It is giving tickets to all the happy customers. Um, I also placed down two ATMs in here just in case somebody really, somebody really, really wants a bag of cookies. Don't worry about it. We got you covered. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to upgrade the runway and put in Run PAPI Precision Approach Path Indicator provides a visual indicator to pilots of their approach angle resulting in increased safety must be placed. All right. That's cool. Let's go ahead and do this. All right. There's one right there. How many can I place? Let's place some more. Why not? We have plenty of money. We're going to make this super safe. No plane is ever going to get a boo-boo while I'm here. We're also going to use this uh, runway ILS. So instrument landing system allows larger airlines to conduct a precision instrument approach. Fewer weather delays and a lower risk of weather-related incidents. All right, yeah, we definitely need one of these. We're going to pull more, some, some of these down. Uh, that's That, that was kind of dangerous. I'm not going to lie. But all right. If, it's, if they say it's safe, I'm going to put down one. All right, now that our airline interest is a little higher, we're going to go ahead and bump this up to $100 per per... We're not going to do that. We're going to set it to $70 per person and bump this up to $2,000. And uh, let's see how this goes. Please don't be horrible. Oh, that didn't even do much. Yeah, let's, let's change it to 100 Oh, wait. Got to wait 12 hours. All right, never mind. Hopefully next episode we can start on a new security area. So, uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to that. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Comment, like, and subscribe for more videos. And I'll be seeing you guys soon.